long-term hodlers sold to sailor. Now, normally when there's capitulation, weak hands sell to strong hands. My argument is that strong hands, long-term hodlers sold to sailor, who even though we like him is a weak hand, okay? Because he's he may have leverage on his balance sheet. Now, this is about Michael Saylor. This is a tweet, tweet from me. Okay, so the SEC document says Saylor bought Bitcoin, right? So how come Bitcoin's not up? Like, don't you remember the days when Michael Saylor would buy Bitcoin and it would be like, Phew. Bitcoin would just be gone. Then you'd find out later it was Saylor who did the buy. Michael Saylor bought Bitcoin and people were like lining up to be like, oh, Mike, are you buying Bitcoin? So, you know, maybe people are afraid to be short, right? They transfer Bitcoin from one person to another. Okay. But short sellers are like, oh, I can't be short at 20. And we've heard this before, right? Oh, I can't be short at 30. Oh, I can't be short at 40. Okay. The longer people go, oh, I can't be short, the more they feed the bear. The more violent it's going to be because I think people psychologically will have more. It'll be easier to short it at 18 than it is at 20. So when people are afraid to be short, that's when you should be short in these advanced crashes or bear markets, not investment advice.